Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows up. Everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Don't make assumptions. Let your life be transformed. When you stop making assumptions, your word becomes impeccable. And your life is completely transformed. Magic just happens in your life. What you need comes to you easily because the spirit moves freely through you. Market-wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 10, NASDAQ off 28, S&P's off 9.5, gold. Gold contract, let me get this up here. Gold contract up $9.90, trading at 2,046 an ounce. We had silver down 50, uh, 25 cents, $24.29 an ounce. Light sweet crude down $2.92, $69.40 a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10 year note up five ticks, trading 111.02. The, the 30 year up a full point at 120.13 in King Dollar. King Dollar right now. Bingo, where are you? Why is that doing this to me? Okay, whoa, look at that thing move. Okay, so King Dollar. There it is. King Dolls up 153. I'll get this straightened out. King Dolls up 153 ticks, trading out at a price point of. Why is it doing this? Sorry about this, folks. Wow, weird. At 104202. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in y'all world. In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, let's go look at the futures first because you had a jobs number come out, the private payroll, the ADP come out this morning. They were looking for 130000 They got 100000 When that happened, you had the S&Ps take off about uh, 20 bucks uh, topside. We had a high out here of a 45.98, and then as soon as the market uh, opened, bottom line has been giving it up uh, since then. Now that being said, what you can see, if we're looking, if you're watching Tiger TV, remember the program's archived, folks. If you're in your car listening to your radio, you will be able to get this. What we've done is that we've come right back to where we actually had some strength yesterday on the way up, and the volumes. A way too light to get to lower price right now. So I don't expect we're going to get to lower price. The lower, lower price today was 45.64. But you can see that that 45.64, see, we're going into, we're going into like, uh, what is that, 600,000? 38,000 on a 10 minute chart. And you're going into that with uh, this one's 15. And the last time we just went in, it's 20. 19. You know, so there's not enough juice to get by this low area. We go into the NQs. We take a look at the NQs. Okay, so the NQs, they got to a high of 16,037, gave it up, gave up, uh, you know, 87 points. We take a look at this. Same, exact same setup. You can see that it's going into how we went top side yesterday. Well, not top side yesterday, but we had that acceleration on the way up. That's a big volume buy right there. It's coming down to them. I don't think it's going to break it. So right now, I don't think it, that low is going to get broken, meaning of today of the 15,844. Uh, Notes and bonds, they just continue to want higher price, folks. Okay, it's pretty amazing. Bottom line is that you get the note and bond market. We get the 10-year right now. That's up five ticks. You got 1.4 million contracts traded, and we are at 4.13. That's where we're at right now. And if we go look at the uh, 30 year, 30 year, same type of setup, just a one way trip on the way up, 120.14. And gold. Uh, the, the thing that's cool about gold right now, it's going to get interesting to see how this shakes out. What we needed, I was talking about this yesterday. First, first what you needed 
you needed a lower low because the way that the gold contract had worked on Sunday night, you know, yes, that's a high volume low high, but it's like, okay, man, you also went into not a low, but you had a, a spike. And when you're looking at volume, what happens is that you want to get under the spike with lighter volume, which we did yesterday. And today you just got an inside day. But that's the building cause. That's the building cause for higher price again. So this is acting pretty good. Um, that's how that baby's set up. We go into the dollar. We take a look at the dollar. There we go. There we go. Dollar index right now. So we're at 104, 200. And we're getting, we're getting close to where I think this is going to go. So this is going to get interesting, man. So the 0.382 is 104.363. What's also happening is that that's where that big bar is on the way down. Now, we're into the bar, but I suspect we're going to get at least to the 0.382. That's how it's set up. And if we get to the 5.0, well, that would be quite a, quite a bounce. We, we, we could get to the 5.0. Uh, but the way things uh, trade, and I'm not quite sure that it will happen. The TLT, the TLT is on a confirmed ABC structure on the way up. It took the B point out yesterday. It took it out with volume, all of the above. So there's real action inside that note market, inside that bond market. You go take a look at some of the higher volume equities out here. This is what we have. You got Tesla's up uh, three bucks. Well, actually, let's do it this way. Let's go into the NDX 100 first and see the strength versus the weakness. You got yeah, Lucent uh, Group, that's up 5.5%. Uh, you got Warner Brothers up 4%. Moderna's up 3 Taken away from it, you got uh, Constellation Brands down 4.8%. Datadog is off 26 And you got Copart is down 2.5%. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in y'all world. Stay right there, folks. We'll come right back.